All right, so here we are in my coin ops build, and as you see, you know, I've had lots of packs, and this is the Killer Instinct pack. Some of the comments were that this doesn't work. I've tested all the games now, they all work. You actually only get four Killer Instincts, although there's even more Killer Instincts like the Nintendo 64 version and uh, the Portables versions, many, many others. So you only get four. Um, the reason why this file is like 30 gigabytes is because you get the newer uh, Microsoft Studios Killer Instinct, which I'm going to play later in this video. You then get Killer Instinct 2 for Arcade and Killer Instinct 1 for Arcade. Also here you have the Xbox One and then right here with the red Killer Instinct logo, uh, you'll notice it has a Super Nintendo controller because that's the Super Nintendo version of it. So all four versions work just fine. Um, I'll play Killer Instinct 2 now because I played uh, the other ones. And uh, this is running MAME. You can, you know, set up your MAME fairly easily. You want to insert some tokens, hit your player one star, and then you can get into it. So you get two arcade versions. Arcade versions, you can absolutely turn on and off the, um, the, um, the shaders and things. The thing that I don't necessarily like about this pack is you already have Killer Instinct 1 and 2 on, um, on the pack okay so you guys get that and you just is, I'm just gonna escape out um, so they're all working good the only thing is like you already have killer instinct on and I think you even have it for Super Nintendo let's see let's go down to K over here so you're really only getting one killer instinct game oh well it adds it to there too okay okay so it adds the Super Nintendo version and then the arcade version you already have on here I wonder if it adds a second one or if it just moves it over. Okay, well they're still there. Uh, but they were already there before, so really the only Killer Instinct you're really adding is the Super Nintendo version and the new Microsoft version. And that's pretty much it. It's kind of weird to me, like why they use pills. I call these pills, but why they use like a pit, like it really, like why didn't they make it, you know, so it matches with all these other logos. That's my biggest beef with it. But uh, it works, it runs good. So here's my CoinOps collection. And all I did was I extracted the file and uh, put it, dragged it into the proper CoinOps area and then it adds it to your collections and you're, it's just drag and drop. But uh, it's, it should, the file name is Killer Instinct Collection by UOG. And then I extract, I cut all that and then I pasted it in my CoinOps next build. It's fairly simple. Uh, but as far as the pack, it's a working pack. Some people say some packs are broken. This one is just fine and dandy and working well. All right, let's see. Okay, now it's on. There we go.
I got him. Nice. So, in conclusion, um, if you want the newer version of Killer Instinct, this is pretty much why you're going to get it. Um, that one little thing is my biggest beef with it. And I understand now this is all part of the, the creator UOG, and he made that last Coin Ops Ultimate Edition that I reviewed uh, about a week ago or so. And um, so it's probably all part of his coin ops build that he's been working on. And he, you know, he even has, I was checking out his YouTube videos and he actually has like, you know, how to make artwork. And so he's really into those, uh, that style of making, uh, you know, the marquees. So um, you can make your own, switch them out. But, you know, for those of you that like plug and play, drag and drop and don't want to do anything else, you know, it will uh, look like that. Uh, if you don't want this new Killer Instinct game, then I would just pass on this pack altogether. And uh, because the original Coin Ops Next build has Killer Instinct 1 and 2 Arcade on it. Um, I'll have to double check if, you know, the Super Nintendo one's on it, but it's so easy to get the Super Nintendo ROM. And then the Nintendo 64 version, I think, is actually already on as well. I actually didn't check that in this video, but it's already on there. If you go to Nintendo 64, you should already have it there. And if not, there's lots of packs that have it. Um, so there you go. Um, I have to say, though, why I left so much content on this game is it was a lot of fun. This new Killer Instinct game was pretty cool. The combos really feel good. You know, like when a game and you hit the combo and it just, it's so satisfying. It was definitely satisfying to play. So that was pretty cool. Anyway, so that's what I think. Let me know what you all think. Killer Instinct pack. And uh, we'll catch you 
on the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want.